In other news, Colorado is going electric. CDOT and state energy officials helped introduce electric semi truck maker Nikola Corp. The company licensed to sell Nikola's trucks in Colorado is Wagner Equipment Corp. Nikola competes head to head with Tesla, but both companies' rigs are part of a bigger effort to reach climate action goals. Nikola unveiled its first electric semi today. I show you what the future of trucking may look like in Colorado very soon. Tuesday's press conference was all about going green in Colorado. CDOT and Colorado Energy officials announced Class 8 Nikola Zero Emission Electric Big Rigs will soon hit Colorado highways. It's really exciting to see a Class 8 semi truck um, available for sale in the state of Colorado. Nikola Corp is selling its trucks in Colorado through Wagner Equipment Corporation. These vehicles are being driven day and night. Um, they're driven over long distances and with heavy loads. Um, and that's because they're delivering the goods and services that everyone in the state relies on. And, you know, with I-70 in the state, you know, we're, we're a major thoroughfare even for other states and commerce. Trucking companies can now order the electric rigs and help clean up Colorado's air. These trucks are less than 10% of the vehicles on the road. They're 22% of our on-road greenhouse gas emissions. They're a significant por portion of our ozone precursor emissions. Kelly says Colorado is leading the pack in this new effort to clear the air. I think Colorado is definitely leading um, on clean trucks. Um, there are a lot of states who are working like we are to um, make their state a friendly environment for zero emission trucks. CDOT officials are working toward a concrete goal. We have a goal to reduce um, emissions from medium and heavy duty at least 45 percent in Colorado by 2050. Ditching gasoline and diesel fuel will immediately save truckers, companies, and their clients a fortune. Drivers will eventually notice big changes, too, as more electric rigs hit the road. First, electric rigs run quiet, and second, the stench of diesel may soon be gone for good.